Hi guys, it's Big Al and welcome to Big Al Sports World and this is our journeyman series with IFK Timra. Now as you probably were unaware, um, we did do a few recordings but never got them uploaded because for some reason my headset speakers have not been working as in every time I spoke it was silence. So they haven't come along and it, I will also apologize that we are still on the laptop because my desktop was on fire with a new power supply and I am now waiting on a refund from the supplier of the power supply who now have to pay for a whole desktop because they destroyed my system board, my CPU and my brand new graphics card because their power supply went on fire and burnt all the way through the cable onto the main board so it was all fun so it's been a really crazy month of january so apologies for the lack of videos at the start of the new year but it's been all hell breaking loose here and obviously i started my new business and that has been absolute manic so not in a bad way a good way because it means i'm making plenty of money but you know anyway so we have had since you guys were last with us we have not had a very good time and um, we now have five games to get 11 points to save our job at timura otherwise we're being sacked and the reason for that is well all this see all this red that's the reason why all this red now as you can see we're nearly at the end of the season so today we're going to play against Galavera Ma Malabarats in the first of the five games to save our job. Now, we did that Hogsville are top of the league. Like, they are actually top of the division. Um, well, they were until Sandvik's. Yeah, San Vickens played. But as you can see, we were 1 0 up, and it was two quick goals in two minutes from them that gives them to give them the victory. Oh, that, we outplayed them. But. I can't remember where you guys were whenever you last joined me at the start of this season. I believe, I believe it was here where we lost 2-1 to Hugsville. But as you can see, we won 4-1. Then we went for two defeats of 2-0 and 1-0. Not so good. Then we beat Mora on 1-0, who are right below us in the league table. Then we drew with Soderhams. Then we went out and lost two games in a row against some victims and Bottoms. Then we beat Pieta, who are above us in the table, three goals to one. But then we went out and lost to Valbo, who are at the bottom half of the table, by three goals to two. And I just don't understand it. Then we went out and beat IFK Mora, 3-0. Then we lost again. I'm expecting this team to beat us to continue this two defeat runs. I don't know, or we're going to pick up a victory. Um, but we need 11 points from five games to secure our job. I have applied for loads of other jobs, just in case we don't do it. Um, obviously, it's time to move on by the sounds of it. Because um, it looks like we're going to get signed. I don't want to get signed. I'd rather resign before... We're not going to get the 11 points by the time we get to the last game. Which you won't see anyway. I will resign. I'm finding our club because... It will kill the reputation. We got, like, one star reputation. I don't want to kill it. And go back to like no reputation to half a star. But as you can see, we are sick for the league. They did want promotion. We're never going to get it. Because some Vikings are currently top. Hugsville obviously have a game in hand. Who beat us 3-2-1 in the last game. And obviously, like I mean, we're battling with like the teams from last season. Hugsville, Honderston, Osterstead and Pieta. Who we were battling with. Who were built like down here last season. Down in 8th and 9th. These two. These three. We're all down there. And as you can see, we've all improved. We're up to sixth, but obviously it's not good enough for the board. They wanted promotion. We're not going to get promotion. I can safely say this team is not going to get promotion. If we get the 11 points, I'd say the cave is our job till the end of the season and they'll sack us at that point. But I don't want to be sacked. So I have applied for lots and lots and lots of jobs. But doesn't mean I'm not going to get any. So what's happened since is we've now switched formation now to a 4-4-2. With zero instructions, playing counter attack football, unstructured. And it's not been doing too bad. We've brought Engelboom back in. Engelboom has had an absolute diabolical season. So we've brought it back in because, like, I mean, we just need someone to try and score goals. And as you can see, we've lost our centre back. He's gone on a free transfer to Bradford City. 
and we're about to lose could be the VPS on a free transfer. All the contracts are run there anyway. And I ain't really doing them because I ain't planning to stay in here. So I might as well just let them go. And Timur can just... Unless we stay, but I'm leaving at the end of the season anyway. So it makes no, no odds. They can go. I'll survive what I have. So today's team on the first game of five to get 11 points is Conchavin in goal with Rinder Roy, Jose Suarez, Fidarsen and... Lalo Balbi adds a right back. In front of them, you got Hansen, who's one of our new signings. The transfer window is on. It is nearly over. We have brought in a couple of players, but I'm not even going to go through them because I'm not going to be here long enough. Hansen on the left wing. Grunley, the youngster, in the middle with Scudalong. Now, if I do leave, these are two players that I would like to take with me. And Jose Suarez. They're the three players that I would probably steal from Timra. I will try and sign him in at the new club, wherever it is, provided it's at a decent enough level where I can get these three. Because he's only, what, 17, 18? Is he? Grumbly? 17 years old, Norwegian. Should should be playing better football than what he currently is. So, we, we he was a bargain whenever we got him on a free. Skunderland, again, another cracking player. So And then Sinclair on the right with Engelblum and Olaroff. Olaroff has been our lifesaver so far. As you can see on the bench, we've got Jukic, Hansen, Kupi, Jensen, another one of the new guys. Hadenis, Sigurdsson and Oswald. And as you can see, there is some new guys down here that haven't even kicked the ball. They're not going to get, probably even get a kick a ball. Like a 19-year-old centre back and a 24-year-old right back. But to be fair, they're probably not going to get a game underneath my term ship. Tito was a new goalkeeper that was brought in. Again... He ain't going to get a game underneath my term ship. It's as simple as that. So, let's get moving on. And again, apologies about the poor graphics. It's going to be jumping. I'm hoping this company can get me my new desktop or give me the money to get my new desktop SAP because I was in the middle of doing the first recording with Timra. At the time, it caught fire and it just went like crazy. My house was... Not very nice, it didn't smell very nice. However, I took the cover off the PC, I was like, oh my god, sent them photographs, the whole heap, because the power supply was, what, two days old? And they apologised, and uh, are going for their own insurance to pay for my gaming desktop, because I just built it. So here we go, expect a jumpy graphics, I do apologise in advance, I'm not going to commentate on the uh, kickoff, I just hope we can get 11 points in five games i would like to start off with three points against this team that would be the start of all starts but i'm not going to hold my breath because we've been shocking this season we start off so so brightly top of the league running away with it and then we just hit a bad patch and it we've never recovered like i even gave up in the wing back position during that bad spell because i was like I don't know what to do. Let's go basic 442, no instructions, and see if we can actually do something. And again, it hasn't really worked. It's worked for a couple of games against the lower league, te against the lower half teams, but nothing major against the upper half teams. And it's really the upper half teams that we need to be beaten that we couldn't do it. So we shall see what can happen. Well, the worst comes the worst. If we get offered one of these other jobs, we're gone. <laughs> So I will keep you up to date on that one anyway. The transfer window ends in a week. Um, I'm not even going to bother signing anyone else in. What's here is staying here. What's leaving can leave. There is a lot of players got contracts out there. Hansen with the cross didn't happen. Easy cleared up. So there's a lot of players leaving the club on free transfer contracts expiring. And I'm not renewing them at present because the board have uh, given me an ultimatum. Well, they've been giving me an old, they've been like harassing me for like the last seven, eight games, and all oh, pressure on the manager for results, blah blah blah. Even though we beat Pieta, who were above us, it was still oh, you, they beat Pieta, but the next game was all oh, pressure on the manager, pressure on the manager. It's like really, there's nothing mean from the board, and then they came out and said you must once the top of the league won't win. Engelblum, there we go, one nothing up. That's what we needed. First three points could be in the bag, 10 minutes in. A lot of not holding out because we scored early on before and lost. 
So yeah, we've had pressure from the media from like we started our losing run. They've just been on our cases ever since. And now the board's on the case as well, so... You know, the tables, I think, was pretty fair for the team we got. But, you know, they want promotion and we can't provide it. The new manager's going to get an easy time because they're just going to want to uh, get top half finish, which I'm pretty much securing them here for them. That's probably why they want 11 points because that will secure them top half, pretty much secure them a top half finish for the season. Twats. But, anyway... Onwards and upwards, Engel Bloom comes back into the team after a few games out right? just because he was playing awful and he gets on the score sheet. Nice setup by Auroff, which he's been scoring the goals for us recently. We have got an 18 year old called uh, Larson, Adam Larson, um, 18 years old from our youth development. He's a 5 star potential rating. He's played quite a few games, he's scored a couple of goals for us. But in his last game was against Hugsville, he was diabolical. He got a 5.7 rating. He was that bad. He missed three sitters as well. And Engel booms in again. Can he score two? Oh, he put it wide. It would have been easier to score. No offense to you. You should be at the keeper with ease now. Never let the keeper save that. Corner kick to us. Hansen with the corner. What's going to happen? Are we going to get on the end of it? No. Can Sinclair get on the end of it? Play it straight back to him. Yes, yeah, swing it first time in. Turn and hit, turn and hit. Oh, disappointed. Sinclair does though, and oh, it went behind his arms and back into them. Amazing teleportation. So guys, yes, as you can see, the graphics are still shockingly bad. I do apologize to you guys. But I'm hoping to improve it. Trying to get it improved. I've actually also per in the process of purchasing a game and laptop as well just in case the desktop takes longer than what is required and they nearly scored um, in case the desktop takes longer than required at least then I can have better graphics and we can still we can then record properly because the worst of it is I just set up all my accounts for my twitch everything on the desktop had it all linked up all ready to go and then it all fell apart so yeah, it's a fun time here at Big Al Sports World. But we will continue on as always. And I think I'm coming down with a cold as well, guys. My nose has been sniffling all day. And the last time I think I spoke to you, I had a cold. So I'm going to blame you guys for, for all this. It's all your fault. <laughs> Nothing to do with me. It's all your fault. Uh, it's not bad. I've actually got a big bottle, two-litre bottle of Coke to set the drink out of because... My voice is starting to go, my nose is starting to get sniffles, it's not good. Grongly hit it son. Oh, shocking effort though. The young 17 year old is pretty sweet from long distance, he scored a couple from there. Up and win. Oh, giving it away lads, two cent ball. Maybe we should put it stuck on. Jose Suarez, what are you doing? Don't, don't make me look like a fool. Oh, you did. You made me look like a fool. Jose Suarez, son. If in doubt, put it out. Set up by my... Uh, he did not set that up. Suarez set that up. I am nearly sure Suarez kicked that ball. Like, he should have kicked it out. Yeah, Suarez kicked it off his foot. Oh, come on. Offside ref, come on. I can't believe we're drawing this game. We need to pick up three points. They're lower than us. Where are they in the table? Where the hell? Really? They're in relegation zone. Oh, this is embarrassing. Do you want to know something? Let's take us off counter. Let's attack this team. We're away. But they're bottom half of the table. We should be smashing them. Oh my god. The time we're going to go 2 0 down. I think these players weren't ready me as well, you know. Because they're not doing much to keep me in the club. They know what's required. They know the board. Look at that. Jose Suarez has done a 6.1. He's one of our better centre backs as well. Phil Arson's pretty good. But Jose Suarez has been rock all season. And now we need to get 11 points. He's just like, oh, I don't care anymore. My boss, is, my boss can leave. But I also have declared interest in a job. I applied for one of them, I think it's in 
Hong Kong or China and they came up saying oh what do you think of this and I was like well anyone would be interested in it from where I'm from a position that I'm in so yeah I might have pissed a few of my players off on my board but they gave me 11 points so they pissed me off so it's only fair apologies for the language but you know I'm Irish I don't really care it's not an overly friendly channel all the, all the time it can be Absolutely shocking, and what is Conshaven doing? How did that? How can you blame Granley for that? What did Granley do? He passed the ball forward. Our striker didn't even attempt to get it. They played some sweet one touch, two touch football. The keeper should have saved it. He did well, he pulls his arms into his body because I stick them out to save it. You see, they're against me. They are against me. So yeah, we're on a second ship now. We lose this. There's no way in hell that we're gonna do it, cause we got. I think we got Osterstand, Harnessons, to play to the next games, and we also have, I think that team, and Bodens. I don't think we're gonna do it. I don't think we're gonna do it. Half time, two one down. Absolutely diabolical. Absolutely, we've, we've annihilated them as well. We've had the better chances. I'm going aggressive. I expect to see a much better showing in the second half. Yeah, you can be deep from Fat Henson. Right. What to do? What to do? What to do? Do do. Five point nine. Oh, I don't. I don't really want to play Haradison because he is leaving us. But do you want to know something? Go in. Stuff it. Let's get him in. Where, do, where does he like to play? You can play where. Well, nowhere. Do you want to something? Stuff it. You can stay in there. Look at that. Um, Koopy's leaving us. Do I, do I put Koopy in? He's more defensive than Grunley. And take, young, take the youngster off. Yeah, let's, let's strengthen it up a little. Yeah, well, we're not going to play you there, are we? Plays a ball with a midfielder on support. That's better. I don't have another centre back. Your centre back's playing shit as well. Damn it. Damn it. Damn it. Fuck it. Let's just go for it. What's the worst that can happen? They, they fit 4-5-0? Four, 4-5-1? Five, four, five, oh, well. These things happen. Definitely got to leave. I'll probably resign quickest. I don't think I'm going to get the points. If we lose this and we lose our next game, I'll probably resign because we're not going to get 11 points in the final three games. And they'll just sack me anyway. <sighs> That's what I mean. Look at that. They're absolutely against me. Olaf, who's been outstanding for the last four or five games, he's been our main man. Awful. Handsome with the cross. Olaf! Yes! Was it Olaf or was it Horizon who's leaving us? It was the man who's going to Bradford City with the winner. With, well, sorry, not the winner, the equaliser. Tactical genius, but a manager. Substitution of the year. Oh, what a finish, two side foot left. Oh, oh, Peach. Pick it out, son. Pick it out. Welcome back to the fold. Even though you are leaving us in, I think, January. Ugh. And of course, then Moron have to go and score. Twats. Oh, they're bitten the league leaders. They're now down the second because of that. Well, so I went one up on them with the boys and they came out and spanked me. So I'm not going to say anything about it. I'll just let them play on. Up and win, up and win. So you did. Come on, all off. That's it. Play it through. Come on, Scotland. What are you doing with it? Hansen. Oh, didn't get it through to all off. Engelbom would have been easier to find, to be fair. Up and win again. The dog do a Suarez. Good lad, Render Roy. Who's also look at? Who's also being targeted to leave? By the way, Render Roy. Um, we've had a few. Uh, Clubs have interest in Renderoy. Bigger, bigger clubs than us as well from different leagues. So, 
Krupe's also leaving on a free transfer. As Olaf picks it up, he skins his man. Olaf! Yes, yes, yes. That's what I'm talking about. He's been the big man for us in the last few games. And yet again, he pops up with another goal. Look at this touch. The ticket past the man. Look at this. Cuts it up through the player's legs. And boom, bottom corner, pick it out. What a comeback. 2-1 down. The 3-2 up. Tactical. Telling you. Substitution genius. Koopy was involved in that. Boom. So was the fucking. So was Hatter. This managerial genius right there. Absolutely shockingly crap managerial genius. To be fair, I have done. Otherwise, I would have run away with this league. I'm 10 points off the leaders. 10 points. Loads of games left, by the way. Absolutely loads. We could probably get the 10 points back, but the, but the likelihood of uh, Sam Vickens losing 10 points is slim to none. And believe it or not, only a few games ago, they were down with us. And they've just, changed, they've just went on a really good run. Since they beat us. <laughs> since they beat us, yes. Since they beat us, they've gone on a really good run. To get back up into it, and Hogsville dropped a few, and Osterston and Har Harnessons have all dropped points. Can we get a fourth? That would be awesome. Henson. Oh, the big man's there again, but it went over the bar. Whew. What a way to say goodbye to your fans, huh? Coming in, scoring a couple of goals, that would be awesome. That's okay, I thought that was us awesome. for a second. I got all worried because it said, oh no, I've only one sub left. <laughs> But we're in this game still. Thank the Lord Almighty God that we're still in it. But three points would be a fantastic way to start. By the way, guys, if I do get another job, I will do a video straight away. Um, anyone who watches the non-league to Premier League, I will apologise now. There was two... Oh, unlucky Sinclair, almost. Uh, there was two recordings to go up, but with my headset having no... Sound for some reason. I have no clue what my computer did. It had disabled the volume on it completely, so I couldn't upload them. And I can't re record the volume because I can't see the screen of what's happening to re record the volume. I've done it once before and it was awful, and I ain't done it again. So I have to scrap the videos. I'm hoping whenever I finish this one, I'll test it, make sure the vol I tested it already to make sure there was volume. There was. But I'm going to double check the volume has worked on the recording. Because if it hasn't, this will be an R scrap video. But hopefully not. And basically you're going to come back and see just the last two games of the season. I do apologise. It wasn't how I wanted to do it. Because you've missed some really, really good games. But we're going to have the end of the season. And get ready for next season. So I will apologise now for that one too. So I don't have to apologise in the video. But then I will apologise anyway in the video because people might not watch this video and watch the other one instead. But we'll see what happens, you know. It's great to be back. Even though we are still on the awful piece on my dying laptop and everything else. But, you know. I'll hopefully have a gaming laptop here in the next couple of weeks because I need it. Oh, great challenge again. Can we do the counter attack? Engel Bloom. Oh, he played it behind him. Olaf picks it up nonetheless. Willie's just skipped past the defender. He swings it in. And Skirkeland! And it is 4 2. I OK, Timra. One of the guys I want to take with me. Yes, yes, yes. Engel Bloom at the edge of it. Olaf again, man. He, he has been outstanding. I might even be tempted to try and take him with me, too. But, oh, what a finish. What a finish. He's been one of our most creative players. Him and Gronley have been very creative all season. Skokeland and Gronley have been really creative. Swire's been a rock at the back. So has Hydenus, but he wouldn't sign a new contract, so we had to let him go. I couldn't for I did try to get him to sign a new contract before all this happened, whenever we were playing really, really well. But he just said no. He did he did wanted to move because Bradford said he want were interested in him from the start of the season, so that's where he's going to. St. Clair, Skungeland, Olaf, can he make it five? Oh, he skips past him with ease. He plays it in. Henson, oh, Henson scored on his debut as well, which was fantastic. But, you know.
Only time will tell. Come on, come on, come on. Oh, and I'm also hopefully going to have a gaming tablet. So I might do FM Touch, a series of FM Touch on the gaming tablet. Because I've been looking at the gaming tablets, Windows 10 gaming tablets. They look very, very sweet. And you can use Steam games on them, which this is. And I have FM Touch, but nothing to play it on because I don't want to put it on my kid's tablet. Because it's not very good. Um, but I have been looking at gaming tablets, so we might be doing a series on FM Touch. So any suggestions, what you fancy seeing on that, that would be awesome. Because obviously I have a uh, recording software. Oh, Ingo Bloom, it's number five! Oh, welcome back, Ingo Bloom! That's more like it is 100th career league goal. And he gets it at IFK Timro, wherever the manager's due to get sacked. Like his style. Talk about turning up all of a sudden in the second half. Unbelievable. That change of tactic to attack in and bringing on those couple of substitutions have really, really rocketed us in this game. Cooper, you can play on injured or not. I don't really care. Four minutes, game set match. But yes, guys, I, I want to know what you fancy seeing on the FM Touch um, if I do get the gaming tablet. I'm probably going to get one anyway. Oh, no, can you make it six? Oh, defend it. But there it is. 5-2 victory, we got 3 points out of 11 that we need, only 4 more games to go, but we could be moving club before then, who knows, but yeah, suggestions, 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 oh, passionate, it's got to be a passionate team talk after that one, what a comeback, superb effort, I'm proud of the whole lot of you, yes I am, thank you very much, they're sick that up your arse you board. Pigs is giving me ultimatums like that. How rude of them, considering I kept you in this division last season. How rude. I took you over, you were in the lower half. I got his mid table. Shocking. Second season, you wanted promotion. Like, really? You didn't even want that la last season. You got you where we are now is where you wanted us to be. I've done that in my second season. It should have been, and that's where it should have been the target. Next season should have been the fake promotion. But, you know. Hey ho. So yes guys, thank you very much for joining us. There's the first three points with four games left to go to get that magic 11 total that the board want. Bomb, bomb, bomb. Um, yes, if I get the game and tablet, suggestions of FM Touch, what do you want to see on that? That would be awesome so I can do it. My stream save, I got a suggestion, but I can't remember who the suggestion was from. I do apologize, dude. I can't remember you who you are. You were a new subscriber to the channel. That's even worse. That's embarrassing. Very unprofessional of me. But thank you very much for your suggestion. I might do the Chinese one as you've requested. Once I get my gaming PC. Oh, my game, I might even do it from my gaming laptop, to be fair. I could stream using that. It just means the chat's going to be awkward to read. Um, but, you know. We could do that anyway. It's going to be on Twitch. My streams are going to be on Twitch because of the YouTube partner program, which I am nowhere near, so I won't be able to stream on YouTube. But I will be able to stream on Twitch, which is pretty sweet. Um, I'm also going to look at all our streaming ways of streaming for you guys so we can actually get a better community going. So, yes, don't worry. You will be able to find me on Twitch. I will have a t link in the description whenever that comes live. So either whenever I get my gaming laptop or this company give me the money to get my new desktop because they're paying for it. Sweet. Um, so yeah, we're well, always starting the series off. Night at last, you've actually seen us win a game. Whoop, 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 whoop. 2018, new plans. We'll start winning matches. That's our total. That's our game. Um, <laughs> so guys, again, thank you very much for coming and watching. Apologies for the lack of videos in 2018 so far. It's, as I said, it's been manic. We've had computer fires. We've had loads of... My new business has really taken off. A lot busier than what I thought it was going to be in the first month. Like, super busy. Um, I've put all that stuff to the side tonight so I can record for you guys. So, apologies. They will be coming back more regularly. Every week again, like they were before. There will be the Motorsport Manager coming back as well. We're going to have our Boyhood Returns. 
We're going to have the last two games of the non-league to Premier League first season ending finale. It's going to be the next video for that, so don't miss that one. And then we we'll can see what our plans are for next season. And that one, IFK Temra, I don't know what's going to happen. I'm going to be playing those, those next four games off the stream, or off the video. So hopefully we do it. If I get a job offer in between times, I'll accept the offer, but then I'll do a video so you guys can see that we've moved club before it even happens. If we're not going to get the point, target of 11, I will resign, go job hunting, and then bring you back for starting a new career with the new club. Because, uh, yeah, it may well happen. So, guys, again, thank you very much for coming and watching. Sorry it's a bit long, but I had to explain everything that's gone off in the last few weeks. So you know that I haven't forgot about you. I am still live. And we are still recording YouTube videos. You would have had about four or five. You would have had about six videos on the channel for the last, like, three weeks. But, unfortunately, with my headset not giving out volume, you haven't had it. So guys, thank you very much. If you're new, like if you like this, the video, hit the thumbs up button. Helps other people watch the video. If you are new to the channel and you wish to see, well, not really see, but hear more of my stupidityness and uh, have a laugh, laugh at me or laugh, enjoy the game. Hit that subscribe button. More than welcome. We love you all. Have a good one, guys. All the best. Thanks. Bye.